Hi, Bill Jones from Turntastic Wood Designs. I made this ink pen out of some scraps of cherry. A lot of wood turners like to do pens because you can do it with very little material and you can make one very, very quickly. So it's kind of a fun project if you don't have a lot of material or a lot of time. And I'll show you how I did it next. You do need a few specialized things to make a pen. For starters, you need a pen mandrel. Here's one that fits in the Morris Taper end of the headstock. And it has a matching live center that goes in the tailstock. And of course, you'll also need a pen hardware kit. There are many different styles. And for each style, there are different sets of bushings that you will need. You also need this special drill bit that is used to trim the ends of the pen blanks. And I'll show you how that works in just a little bit. Once I gathered all my things, I cut a piece of scrap cherry three quarter inches square. Then I cut that square piece to length just barely longer than the brass inserts from the kit. So as you can see, the blanks aren't very big at all. Next, it's over to the drill press where I drill a seven millimeter hole through the length of the blank. I spread a little CA glue on the brass inserts and spray some activator in the blank and that holds it nice and secure in just a few seconds. Now it's back to the drill press using that special drill bit I mentioned earlier. The shaft fits perfectly inside the brass insert and then the wider part trims your blank perfectly square to the shaft. Now you mount the bushings and blanks on the mandrel per the instructions that come with the kit. And then you start turning. At first I turn with an easy tool because as the name implies it's really easy to use. And when I have the blanks really close to the size of the bushings, I switch to a skew chisel to get a really fine finish. And very little sanding is required. For a durable finish, I just spread on a little CA glue. I follow the instructions that come with the pen kit to assemble the pen using a pen press. If you don't have a pen press, this can be done using a simple bench vise. Well, this is a, a fun project that can be done really quickly. Uh, I hope you liked this video and found it informative. If you did, please like and share with your friends. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It really helps me out. And as always, thanks for watching.